usually the starting point after Jake Roth kicks one away. O'Malley is the quarterback, although we saw two quarterbacks a week ago. Cole Northrup we intend to see again today. O'Malley will throw, and it's caught at the 30-yard line. Catch made by Quinn Grittak. They love to spread the field. To really work you short horizontally early on in the game. O'Malley on the shotgun. Selwyn Simpson is the running back on second down and four from Lafayette 31. And motion goes to tight end, retracing to the left side. O'Malley takes a snap. Handoff is to Simpson. He is wrapped up by eight, maybe nine blue jerseys at the line of scrimmage. Reader was there first, and so was Caleb Ashworth, but then came a swarm of blue. Caleb Ashworth is very quick down the line. He works laterally as well as anybody in the CAA from the nose tackle or a three technique position. In motion goes the wide receiver Nick Pearson. Pressing is Ray Jones. O'Malley to throw. Has some time. Out of pocket. Being chased. Kitchen chasing him. Passes caught, I believe, at the 40, but there was a flag back around the 20. I believe there was a hole. Alley come out. He did rotate with Cole Northrup a week ago. Took just about every snap last year as a true freshman from Beverly Hills, California. He pumps, wants to throw, going deep. Has a man. It's Pearson out of his reach as he dies for it. And down in 10 from his own 25 yard line, 848 first quarter. O'Malley throwing. And it's caught by Quinn Revere, his second catch of the day, this time to the 37-yard line, enough for a... Simpson standing next to him in shotgun on first and 10 from their own 37. Simpson's going to get the carry on a counter play oh, to the outside, and Kobe Reeder tracks him down. Minimal gain, maybe a yard. O'Malley had a shotgun for him on second down and nine from their own 38-yard line. Two wide receivers to the far side right. 7-0 Delaware leads as O'Malley being pressured by Cam Kitchen. O'Malley throwing it towards the sideline, and he gets it off and out of bounds. Cam Kitchen was a feet away from his first sack. Line ball in the Lafayette 38-yard line. Running back is Mike Dunn next to O'Malley. Trips to the far side right. O'Malley dropping back. Throwing middle of the field behind his intended receiver tipped up and incomplete. Zadok Scott running backs with him. One behind him, one to the left, one to the right. Right for Cole Northrup, the sophomore from Florida. They'll give it to the running back, JJ Younger. He's got some speed to the outside, but can't turn up field as the linebacking core of Delaware collapsed on him. At eight. Coming up from Lafayette, 27-yard line. High snap, he takes it. The lefty quarterback looking, stepping up in the pocket, having some pressure. Gets away from the pressure, slides in front of Troy Reeder at the 33-yard line. His feet at the 25-yard line. The snap will be from the 33. In motion goes Will Eisler. They'll go play action. Northrop going to throw down the field and nearly intercepted. The closest man to the play was KC Hinton. Miscommunication on the route between the quarterback. Lafayette will stay with Cole Northrop for the second straight possession under center. The man that returned the kick, Simpson, to the outside left. And Delaware Jersey's all over, and he'll lose one. Back to the 49. Looked like Reeder was there. Northrop. Of one today. Trying to pass downfield to Pearson. High snap over the head of Northrop. Back at the 34 yard line. He just has to fall on it. Now Northrop sends his wide receiver Chenoweth in motion and slot. Another high snap, but Northrop gets it. Pressure coming. Arvin Ware is there. And somehow the quarterback was able to flip. In the first half, in motion goes to tight end, retracing empty backfield for O'Malley. Takes the snap out of shotgun form. Pressure coming. He throws a dart caught at the 20-yard line, and Delaware trying to get that football loose as they held the tight end up, brought him down at the 23-yard line. Jake, the running back, split next to O'Malley, the quarterback. Third down and seven. 
Ball in Lafayette, 23-yard line. Shotgun snap. Here comes pressure. O'Malley throws high for his man. An incomplete looking for Quinn Revere. See what they can do in 62 seconds left in this first half of football. In motion, the tight end. O'Malley has some time, throws, and it's dropped by Mike Dunn. Hit him right in the hands on a slant in the first half. Delaware leads 21 nothing. In motion, Chenoweth. O'Malley, the quarterback. Got a shotgun. Ball in the Lafayette, 38. He turns, looks, here comes some pressure. His pass is caught by Pearson, not for much. Across the 40, and up to the 42. Great push on that last play by Cam Kitchen. Good to see him so mobile coming off that injury. O'Malley for Pearson again. This time it drops. Game last year. That's impressive stuff. That's what you want if you're a quarterback, though. On football in your hands, O'Malley takes a shotgun snap, finds his target. First down yard is to Revere. Revere seems to be his favorite target. Back goes in motion on first down and 10. The Lafayette 44 yard line. That's just the second first down of the game for Lafayette. O'Malley has all day to throw, does so wide to his tended receiver. The running for the running back behind O'Malley. Shotgun snap to O'Malley. He throws outside. It's caught and out of bounds. And Delaware. 21 nothing. O'Malley, shotgun form. Jones showing some pressure. It's picked up. O'Malley steps, throws, caught by Spigner at the 40 yard line. First down pickup to the 36 of the Bethlehem Catholic as well. First and 10 at the Delaware 37 yard line. O'Malley. Shotgun snap, looking, throwing, down the field for Pearson. Throw it too far, an incomplete. Pearson had a beat last week, and now Caleb Ashworth. His second week plan wearing Delaware blue, looking a little bit better. Trips the outside left, second down and 10 for Delaware 37. Here comes Colby Reader, forcing O'Malley to throw the football quickly. Taggart does catch it. Five, Lafayette converted their first third down moments ago. They'll try to make it two on this drive. Delaware showing pressure. O'Malley, here comes the pressure, throws it away, and it's incomplete. He was looking for Man in motion, it's Pearson. Here comes Ray Jones off the edge, forcing O'Malley to throw a screen pass. It's dropped, incomplete turnover on down. O'Malley, who has taken most of the snaps. We have seen Cole Northrup, but Sean O'Malley, 11 of 21 for 73 yards on first and 10 from his own 33, will throw high and out of bounds. Looking for Chenoweth, but really looking to get that football. Backs in the backfield with O'Malley. O'Malley second and 10, back to throw. Pressure coming, gets it away, caught by Dunn, and he gets up to the 37 yard line. As such a youngster, we'll wish the best for J.J. Younger as he was helped off the field after our Newark Urgent Care injury stoppage. Third down and five from the Lafayette 38-yard line. O'Malley throwing pass, caught first down yardage to the 46-yard line. Chenoweth goes in motion, empty backfield. Five wide receivers on the field for O'Malley to choose from. Some pressure coming from Delaware. Down goes O'Malley. <laughs> And he is a big presence on the defensive line. Second down and 22, and he was held up that time. No penalty flag thrown as six gets a catch at the 40. Flag comes late. Ball loose. Picked up by Armin Ware. Delaware has the football. A lot going on. Team team uh, now with the New York Giants. It's Kyle Laletta. First and 10 for the 39 for O'Malley. Pumping. Throwing behind a target, nearly intercepted out of the hand of Johnny Buchanan. And another true freshman almost had an INT Buchanan from Brooklyn. Third quarter, retracing from right to left is the tight end as O'Malley takes the snap from his own 39. Pressure coming. He avoids it. Rolling out to the right. O'Malley not as comfortable on the run. Throwing downfield. Batted away by Nasir Adderley. There was Buchanan and Tenny Adelusi in the area from the backside. Adderley swatted away. Boy, Adderley covers so much ground from that safety position. He read O'Malley's eyes as he escaped the pocket and rolled right. That's one of the problems you see with O'Malley. Instead of there just running himself for some yardage, 
or throwing the ball away. He tried to fit it in there. In the opener against Sacred Heart. Third down and 10. Delaware leads 28-0. Lafayette with the football on their own 39. Delaware showing pressure with Troy Reeder. It's picked up. Reeder trying to get his way to the quarterback. O'Malley slings it to his attendant receiver, Quinn. With in motion on first and 10 for the Delaware 37 yard line. O'Malley with the fake, throws to Chenoweth. Screen pass caught at the 40, up to the 35. And down he goes at the 32, Ray Jones. California, Texas, you've heard, Florida as well. Chenoweth playing in his 33rd career game. Two of those previously coming against Delaware. Second down and five from the Hens 32 yard line. O'Malley pumps. Here comes Kitchen. O'Malley has to throw it to the Lafayette sideline. There was a after 0 of 6 to start. It's third and five, Delaware 32 yard line. O'Malley, pressure coming. Throws a dart towards the sideline at the 25. Lafayette's first red zone visit of the evening. Back split next to O'Malley. Two wide receivers at the top. Adawusi showing pressure. O'Malley gets the football off. It was incomplete late by getting the ball out. First and 10 for the 24. O'Malley chopping his feet. Throwing towards the end zone. In traffic, Nas Adderley with his first interception of the season. Never throw late over the middle, and that's exactly what O'Malley did. Adderley sat back in his deep safety position and just read O'Malley's eyes, worked himself to it. A really fine play, but it starts with identification, understanding what the quarterback's trying to do, the pattern, alignment, and then taking advantage of it, reading the quarterback. That's why he is an All-American. A fumble recovery, and now his first interception after having five a season ago. He forced a fumble last week against Rhode Island. Nasir Adderley.